Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are a new subscriber, please don't forget to subscribe. If you are an old subscriber, thank you so much for supporting. Please turn on your notification bell so that when I do post, you guys will be able to see it. Um, I am bringing you guys another makeup tutorial and this time we are going to be featuring Colored Rain. I got a PR box from them and I mean, I was like... Hallelujah. I was like so excited because it was a lot of makeup and I'm going to show you guys the box that came in and all the makeup that's in there. I did kind of like, you know, throw it around so it's not as organized as it was when they sent it. Um, For this look, I used the Beauty Rust Palette and I used two colors literally. Is it two? No, sorry. I used three colors out of this palette for this look. And then for the lips, I also used the lipstick. I used the shade um, Nude and also, I believe, Brown Sugar. No. Okay, sorry. So for the lips, I used Mocha and then I used Nude. That's the shade I used to get this lip color. Like, I am obsessed with this look. Um, I will be doing a lot more makeup tutorial for you guys. And like I said, with my hair stuff, I will be doing it on the mannequin. So I have a tutorial coming. So don't worry for all my subscribers who only follow me for hair, um, hair tips. Look at all this. Like, this is a lot of makeup. Like, yes, honey. I was like, yeah, thank you. I am, like, super duper excited. I mean... I can honestly say I probably have all their lip collection, which is like freaking amazing. They also sent me the Queen of Heart palette. Charlie, let me speak my African English. They also sent me the Queen of Hearts um, palette, which I have been dying to get. Like, I wanted this palette so bad. And to finally have it in my possession. You people don't understand. And then the next palette that they also sent me is Cheers. Cheers to this beauty. However, hey, ruffle. The next palette that they also sent me is the Cheers to this beauty palette. However, I already have this palette. So this is like my second one, I guess. Um, and then the other one is the Beauty Rust, which is what I used to get this, to create this look. Then the next one is the Love Lies palette. Love do lie, child. And then the next palette is Smoke Show. I haven't used this one yet, of course, but I really like, I love a good smoky eye. So I am definitely going to be using this one. Um, and then the next palette that I also got is the Colored Rain palette. However, I already have this, so now I have two. I think I'll do like a giveaway later on in the future i don't know or i'll probably just give it to a friend i don't know and then the last palette is the very cute palette i haven't opened this one yet but i'm like super excited to see what it looks like inside and then the rest of the stuff in the box is just straight up lipstick lip gloss lip whatever like lip everything i got 66 lip gloss stick whatever matte metallic whatever like all in total there's 66 of them in this box so thank you color frames okay so if you guys want to see how i created this beautiful look please keep on watching it is very simple i know it probably looks like it's complicated but trust me it is not one thing that you guys will learn about me with this whole makeup thing is I do have days where like I do dramatic looks or whatever but most of my looks are looks that you can wear out looks that like anybody can do as long as they practice so keep on watching give me a thumbs up comment let me know what you think type of looks you guys would like to see and I will see you in my next video bye so we are going to start off with prepping our skin and I am using the pixie glow tonic serum <laughs> that was a mouthful and I'm going to put that all over my face so next is moisturizing and I am going to use this gel moisturizer by pixie so next is the brows for my brows I really don't do much with it I just take a concealer and um, clean it you know the top and the bottom um, just that's just it I don't fill it in before I clean it I actually clean it I kind of like arch it out 
before I fill it in because I don't like wasting products. Like these brow products are very expensive to be wasting. So I just <laughs> I just go ahead and I just fill it in. And once I fill it in, um, I take my Anastasia Beverly Hill um, brow gel and I use that to fill it in. One trick that you can also do is outline your outline it before um, cleaning it. And with that, you can use a pencil. I like the NYX pencil. I also like the Benefits Cabral pencil. So next we are going to go ahead and take a concealer brush, a blending brush, whatever you prefer to use. And we are going to blend out the concealer. Um, just bring it down and just blend it out. And then also you want to make sure you blend excuse me, the concealer at the top because if it sits there and dry, it leaves a line that you do not want because once that line is left, it is very hard to blend it in. So you want to make sure you blend it while it's still wet. So now for the fun part, we are using the Colored Rain Beauty Rust Palette. It's a very small but powerful palette. So I am going to take the shade Dusk and I am going to use that to kind of like outline out how I want um, my eyeshadow to be um, some people use tape you know to make sure they get like a really clean um, look but I'm just using a very small I think this is like a smudge brush I'm not really good with the brushes and the names but I just pick up whatever I think will work and I use it and 100% of the time it works so I'm just gonna use that to kind of like outline out how I want the brows to be um, just placing the shadows I did not set my concealer some people like to set the concealer I however find that when I set the concealer with a powder the pigments on the of the shadows are not as um, pigmented I guess that's the word so now I'm taking the same shade Dusk and I'm going to place that in the um, inner corner or the outer corner. Yeah, the outer corner. I'm just packing that on. When you put it on, it kind of looks like it's orange. But then as it settles into the, the concealer or the eyes, it turns into this like burgundy shade it's a really cool color i love it so once i am done with that i am taking the shade recharge and i am placing that right above the shade dusk and and i'm kind of like blending it but i'm really not blending it you know like it's like slightly blending <laughs> but i'm just placing that right on top of the shade dusk so I went ahead and switched out the brush and I am using a much smaller brush. Like I said, I really don't, I'm like a rebel when it comes to the brushes. I don't really use them for what they are meant for, whatever works I use. So I'm using that brush and like I said, I'm just kind of like placing the shade, I forgot what it's called. I am placing the shade recharge um, right on top of the shade dust and I'm kind of I'm blending it out now so the first shade you just want to make sure you place it on your lid then the second shade you can go ahead and blend out so once that is done I am going to go ahead and cut my crease you can go ahead if you are a beginner, you know, like place the concealer right on your lid, open your eyes, and then wherever the concealer touch, that is where your crease will be at, and you can cut it. However, for me, I'm used to this, so I just go ahead and just cut the crease. So now I am going back in with the shade Recharge, and I am going to use that to blend out the edges of the concealer, make sure that it is not harsh. Um... So yeah, the shade Recharge, I am using that to blend out the harsh line. And then once that is done, I am going to go in with my lid color. So for the lid, I am going to use the Cheers to the Beauty palette also by Colored Rain. And I'm using the shade Rosy from that palette. It is such a gorgeous gold. I wanted a gold and I just, I couldn't help it. It's so pretty. And the brush I am using, I am also obsessed with. I got this brush from CVS. I will leave the name in the description um, box below, but 
I feel like it's the perfect brush for placing shimmers on the lid. So I went ahead and finished off the rest of the face. For lashes, I am using Aquaba. I feel like this is like so cool. I will leave the link in the description box below if you guys want to get it. This is like, I love the name. I love the packaging. Like I love everything about the lash and I actually love the actual lash itself. So I will leave the description box. I'm sorry, I will leave the name and everything in the description box if you guys want to order it from her. So for the lips, I am using Colored Rain Liquid Lipsticks and these are in the shade Mocha and Nude. I am obsessed with the Colored Rain like formula, the liquid lipstick formula. I love the fact that like it, when you apply it, it doesn't dry like right away. I have some like liquid lipsticks that the moment you apply it, if you don't blend it right away, like you're screwed because it dries and it's very hard to blend. I love the fact that when you apply this though, like it's kind of still, I guess like wet or has like a glossy feeling. It gives you time to blend everything out before it dries. And I just like, I love, 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 love the formula. That's it guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Right now I'm just setting my face. Turn on your notification bell. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for the support. I appreciate it. Bye.